welcome to the Startup Espresso. I'm Hall T. Martin, the host of the show, where we talk about raising funding for your startup and the time it takes to have an espresso. I hope you enjoy this episode. Hello, this is Hall T. Martin with the Startup Funding Espresso, your daily shot of startup funding and investing. Product development requires a team approach. Here's a list of key points to consider. Assess the skills of each team member to understand the group's capabilities. Set goals for the team before the project sprint begins. Lack of clarity causes confusion among the team members. Check feasibility of the project sprint before launching it to make sure the team is on board. And break down big projects into a series of smaller ones that you can execute on. Use a Kanban or card-based tool to track the projects. It will highlight where there are too many bottlenecks. Use Scrum as a framework to manage the meetings, the tools, and the roles for the team members. The project manager needs to exercise leadership in resolving conflicts among the team and setting priorities for projects. There's a trade-off between quality, speed, and cost of which you get too. It's important the team buys into the trade-offs made along the way. Thank you for joining us for the Startup Funding Espresso, where we help startups and investors connect for funding. Let's go start up something today. Paul T. Martin is the director of Investor Connect, which is a 501c3 nonprofit dedicated to the education of investors for early stage funding. All opinions expressed by Hall and podcast guests are solely their own opinions and do not reflect the opinion of Investor Connect. This podcast is for informational purposes only and should not be relied upon as a basis for investment decisions.